In this video, we're going to demonstrate to you how to use the new quiz feature in Canvas to take all your quizzes from various point values and make them into a standard 100 points. So I'm going to walk through one of my HVAC courses on how to do this. Your courses may be a little bit different in terms of how they're set up, but the same procedures will work. The first thing you need to do is go into settings. Okay, from the settings tab off of your main course screen, we need to go to feature options. If you scroll down here to the bottom, you will see one that says new, qu new quizzes. We have to turn that on. We have to turn new quizzes on. Okay, once we turn new quizzes on, you can go back and click on your home. There's no save on that um, page. Go into quizzes. And then on the right side of every single quiz, you're going to hit the three buttons and migrate. Just go straight down the list, the three buttons and migrate. And again, we're going to do them all. Nothing is going to show up on this screen changed, and that's okay. We're going to come back to this screen once we have everything else done. The next thing you want to do is click over on your assignments from your left menu. And if you don't see this left menu, just click on those three lines at the top. So you're going to click assignments. Now, all the way down at the bottom, you're going to find an area that says Migrated Quizzes. Before we put these in the correct categories, there's one thing we're going to do. We're going to go in and click Edit, and you're going to change the point value on all of these to 100. And once you do that, you'll see under it, it says 100 points. But I want you to come through and change the point value on all of these to 100. Again, three dots, Edit, go to 100 points. This is relatively quick, so I'm going to go ahead and just do this. And right now, I re I'm really not looking for what it, what it is. Okay, I'm not looking at the contents of the quiz, but all of our quizzes, all of our assignments need to be at 100 points, and that's what I'm doing here. Because if you don't have it on 100 points, it's not going to work in the gradebook properly in Canvas. Okay, now that they're all at 100 points, okay, we're still going to ignore the prior assignments here, okay? We're going to ignore everything else. But we're going to drag each one of these to where they should be, okay? We know that that's homework. We're going to just drag week two quiz up. Drag week three quiz up. That should be the end of my quizzes here. I have an exam. Okay, I have a final exam. Okay, um, scavenger hunt we're going to leave as a quiz. I have homework, and there will be some duplicates because the old quiz activities are still there. We'll take care of that and as we work through the rest of this. So don't worry about if you have two that says week one homework. Okay, and I still have one more homework up here. So we're going to go up there, and I still have a Have You Read the Syllabi. Um, I usually leave that as a quiz because that's sort of important. Okay, so now I have everything in the correct categories. So now I need to come over to Modules, which is basically my course homepage. 
we have one task we have to do in the modules okay you have to find every activity that's the old quiz based and you can see this by it looks like the little rocket ship next to it so anytime you have an old the old style quiz you have to replace it with one of the new quizzes okay the easiest way to do this is to start at the top of your course and so we know that that is um have you read the syllabus i'm going to add it okay i have a homework week one i'm going to come in and add it okay and all you're doing is adding an activity then you drag it to the correct place okay notice i haven't deleted anything until i have my old my new activity right there so you have two activities here one is at 100 points one is at 19 points get rid of the one by three dots and remove that's at 19 points okay you only want the ones the new ones that's very specifically say 100 points okay so all we're doing is doing a replacement once you've replaced everything in a module collapse the module make it easy on yourself okay so again i'm looking for anything with the rocket ship which is the quiz format don't have anything in topic two or module two um, don't have anything in module three okay there's a lab down here it's already a hundred points don't have to worry about that deal with labs at a different point now I have a week one quiz here okay that has to be replaced so what we're gonna do is we're gonna at the top of the module the plus sign okay I'm gonna come down to quizzes I'm gonna find week one quiz I'm gonna shove it in there and I'm gonna put it up under the other one and I'm gonna delete the old one you have to remember to remove them as you go through here okay I have a week two homework here okay it's a quiz format you can tell by the little rocket ship and if you hold your if you hold your mouse over the icon you can see it so I'm gonna get rid of that week two homework okay I'm, it always adds to the bottom so remember to drag it up where it needs to be okay then I'm gonna remove the old one and I'm going to eliminate that topic. So again, I'm going to look down. I do this module by module. There's a scavenger hunt here good, with the old rocket ship. So I'm going to get my scavenger hunt. It's under quiz. There it is. Okay, it's already next to each other. I'm just going to get rid of the old one. And when I go back to rearrange the assignments, I'll remember to move that to the lab. So again, there's a week two quiz. I'm going to find my week two quiz, stick it in there, pull it up to the top where it needs to go get rid of the old one okay I'm gonna pause the video while I do the rest of these and then when I come back we'll um, go in and do the last part of it okay so I have now gone through the complete course and um, done everything on the module side now we got to go back to the quiz screen because I have to get rid of these old quizzes or it's going to be, okay, this is our original quiz screen, not the migrated ones. When you migrate it, it doesn't actually, um, it doesn't actually get rid of everything. So we want to go ahead and delete them, okay? So I want to delete all the old quizzes. And I did have a duplicate in the migration. I'll go take care of that in a second. And again, just be very careful before you do this step of it. 
to make sure that you have migrated everything and accounted for everything. This is why I don't delete anything before I make sure that the modules Oops, I hit edit instead of delete there. So let's go ahead and we're going to delete that. Okay, so now my this is all empty. Okay, I want to come back into assignments because I did have one duplicate migration down at the bottom which I'm just going to remove because, again, I have a quiz one here assigned. This isn't assigned to a section, so I'm going to remove that. And then I just had to remember I had that one activity that I just want to move into a lab. So that scavenger hunt there, I want to push that into a lab because that's where it should be. So we're going to move the scavenger hunt here. I'm going to just put it at the end of the labs. And then since this migrated quizzes is empty, let's just get rid of that assignment group. Okay, now starting from the top, we just want to double check that everything is equal to 100. I'm looking for anything that's not equal to 100 points. Because otherwise the gradebook won't work properly. Okay. So we're at everything is equal to 100 points. We're fine. Okay. Um, and that takes care of the migration of the, of the quizzes. All quizzes are at 100 points and all assignments are at 100 points.